Hello, 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 hello. How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the Golden Goblet series. Day six, Clubhouse Games, Mancala. I've never played this before. I have no idea what it is. Um, I'm seeing some fancy looking infinity stones, infinity gems, and a bunch of wooden trays. Um, now before you say anything, what's new? This is always the point in time where if I go in extremely blind to something, people say, Malf, I wish you had to practice a little bit. If I had a gone in and practiced a little bit and then done anywhere close to well, people would then say, not everybody, but some people would say, Man, I wish Mouth went in blind. It's like that time I practiced. Uh, the I did the tutorial for bowling uh, in this, just so I knew how to the controls. I didn't know it was motion controls. And then my the 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 next game I bowled a perfect game. And there was an individual that said, "I wish Mouth didn't do that." Second, and not even second game ever. Really? Mancala. <sighs> it's just, you know, you know, you know. Anyways. Mancala is all about planting. Planting. Like oh! Seeds? seeds? Oh, I see. You pick up the seeds and drop them in their little holes. You get to choose which of your pockets to move stones from. Okay. And these six pockets are mine? Yeah. The goal is to collect the most stones in your store. Sure. Oh, what's the catch? Salmon. There's one other twist you should know. Yeah? If you drop your last stone in an empty pocket, it's capturing time. Oh, you've got to drop a hey, seed in each seeds. Nice. pocket on the way. The game ends when one player runs out of stones in their pockets. Yeah. So whoever has the most seeds in their store survives the winter. I mean, wins the game. I How get it. Work, you ask? We'll figure it out as I we mean, I, I get the principle. I, I like, I mostly like that they keep saying seeds. Alright, well, let's, uh, I mean, we're still searching for a player. So, let's, uh, take advantage of our, the wait time. Take turns moving the stones from your pockets. Whoever has the most stones in their store at the end of the game wins. Pick up the stones from one of your pockets, moving counterclockwise. You'll drop a stone into each pocket you pass until you run out. You also drop a stone every time you pass your store. Every stone in your store counts as one point. Game is over when one of the players... Oh no. I didn't get to practice. William, no. Let me practice. Okay. So I guess the, the stones go, they go counterclockwise the whole way. That's what I wasn't getting at first, right? So like they'll end up going past my, maybe? It's gotta be a catch cause I'm, oh, so now if I'm, can you only carry four now? How many can I... You get an extra turn? Oh. I gave him one. Okay, that was my bad. Extra turn? Capture. What the fudge? All right. Clearly, I wasn't paying attention. Capture. 
capture. What is going on? Don't I get to capture? I made it all the way around. I don't know. All right, just beat me, William. He's captured me twice. It's clear he's got an idea. If it was just once, I might be like, all right, that's a fluke. This guy, he's, he's counting cards. Extra turn. Suck on that, William. Oh, do I have to put one in? Yeah, I don't know. I've got four. He's got like 40. Like, I don't actually... Unless I get like all of them. Sure, take an extra turn. I don't care. Oh yeah, sure. Just take an extra turn. Extra turn? Why not? What the Why heck? Turn? Any... I don't... So, if you put a one in an empty one, do you get what's on the other side? Is that what's happening? I think I get that now. I wish I... Stance. Take the stance. This is, this is why like I like to play a game once before um uh I compete. It's frustrating. It, the losing is frustrating and the losing when you're like you're figuring out what's going on that's what's frustrating okay mouth you gotta learn to make better moves than that yeah see will you it, it's it, you go for the extra turn which means I kind of Trust me, I've got this under control. Oh no, don't. Okay. So I want to like capture his stuff. But I can't. I, uh, I think I need to play against, like, the computer AI on easy to really get a feel for it. Yeah, see, he's, he's making it so I can't capture his crap. Oh, uh, see, I can't capture. Can I do this? Capture. Let's go! I get it now. You take what's on the other side. Yes! Let's go! Capture. No, that was a big one. I'm just giving him free points. At least this time, you know, I learned something and I applied it. My first move, I made the same. Even when I did the first time, I was like, no, 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 that's wrong. Oh, he's making it so I can't. You got to put them into an empty one. Otherwise, you can't capture.
So to get an extra turn, I think you need to end by putting oh fudge your gem in your store. If the store gem isn't the last gem, capture. at least take those. Okay, so capturing's huge. I mean, yeah, extra turn. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I get it. Now I like the game. Now that. Uh, I mean, I didn't hate it, but I enjoy playing it. <laughs> oh, fudge off. He's going to capture those two. Capture. Okay. I get it. All right, he wins. Um. Okay. He beat me. Good job, William. Um... What can I say? What can I say? It's one of those things too, even if you if they tell me that stuff, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna remember the rules unless I actually see them in action. That's a big thing for me. Seeing something actually in action. I very much that's how I learned a lot of things. You know, you reverse engineer something too. You like you look at it, you're like, huh. You gotta take it apart to really to really get it. I took the game apart. I get it now. Uh, anyways, thank you for hanging. Uh, I appreciate it. Sorry for, uh, for my saltiness. This is early. I haven't even had my coffee yet. Okay. So I'm a little, little cranky. It's a bad time to record. Record it late at night. I'm too tired. Record too early in the morning. I'm too cranky and tired. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for hanging out. If you like the video, please give it a like. If you're new around here and you want to see more, uh, subscribe. Uh, best of luck to Ryan and Daniel, who I'm sure... Um, I think both of them are familiar more so with Mancala than I am. So, uh, best of luck to them, even though they probably beat me. Uh, you never know. Anyways, thank you so much for hanging. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, peace out.